What's going on guys, Shanti here, and today I want to, you know, talk, discuss, you know, the comeback of Star Wars Battlefront 2. Now, we all know how Star Wars Battlefront 2 launched. It launched insanely, insanely shaky. When I mean shaky, it was basically the progression system was, you know, held behind a paywall and loot boxes and the community outraged, the game sold poorly, and Disney was not happy with this product. Now, two years removed from that, situation about you know actually yeah, it has been two years actually no it has not been it's been a year and a half things are looking a lot better and what i mean a lot better is that i am actually playing this game a lot like i am thoroughly playing this game a lot and with the anakin skywalker update the chosen one update geonosis obi-wan dooku grievous and a bunch of other clone wars updates this game has become it has become insanely just fun and desirable now they really haven't added too much we have a new game mode coming out this month so definitely stay tuned for that on this channel but besides that you know what has changed what did have they done to make this comeback to having a very very good star wars game i'm not going to call it great because again the beginning was very shaky and a lot of a lot of mess up things but what has made this game insanely good again and there's two things now the first year of content of updates was insanely poor now I personally like The Last Jedi, but The Last Jedi DLC wasn't something I was intrigued about. Same thing with the solo. I enjoyed the solo film, but again, the DLC update was not something I wanted or intrigued about. So yeah, the lack of content, and in that span of the year, first year, they were just fixing the progression system and a lot of other technical issues with the game. And then a year removed, we started getting insane content updates monthly and community events. and It just felt a lot better. It felt like what we were promised in the beginning of seasons of events all the time stuff like that and that's what it feels like it feels like you know battlefront 2 ea has kind of delivered their promise of you know of you know free content of it being continuous too now along with that i feel like the main focus is the fact that they're just purely dumping out clone wars content now the prequels as a movie you know are not favorites of course the original trilogy is the og we all know that but when it comes to the game and star wars games in general we tend to have the most fun i've noticed with the clone wars stuff and the fact that we're getting we've got four new heroes in the clone wars a new map that we fully desired and we got an insane amount of customization with the clone troopers outfits i feel like things are looking very bright and if they continue this trend Looking into, you know, Battlefront 3 or even the rest of this year of con or support for this game, things are going to be remarkable. Now, there's one thing I am kind of nervous about when it comes to Battlefront 2, and that's the fact that they're going to run out of stuff. Now, the way they're going, they're going insanely, and there's a shit ton of Star Wars stuff out there, but to a degree, how much stuff can they, you know, add without it being you know without it being something else similar to something else like anakin skywalker is remarkable his abilities are insane and they're really unique while there is like you know a little bit of different variations that are actually seen but they're very they're changed up to a different format they're insanely good and i'm pretty impressed with how they in introduced him in the game and they definitely paid attention to the, the source material but again after that i'm like are they gonna bring in ahsoka are they gonna bring in padme what are they gonna bring that's gonna be different now they could bring in asajj ventress that is completely you know the next line of heroes could be asajj ventress and ahsoka tano i would love to see that like absolutely love to see that now they can go in with you know they can go cad bane or they can go padme amidala there's a lot of stuff they can do when it comes to the content but again depends how they do it how they make it different and stuff like that but ending off this video the biggest part about the star wars you know the comeback of star wars battlefront 2 is you know the continued support of dice and ea mo and, uh, motive and criterion they you know they supported this game and they've not stopped and i think that despite all the criticisms despite all the hate their support of the game has brought a very fun experience an experience i love to dive into in general now, if you, you know, if you played Star Wars Battlefront 2 and you stopped when it launched, I highly encourage you to go back in there. Now, it might be a little frustrating because you got to get all those credits, get all those heroes. Don't worry, I was kind of in that boat too. But again, it's insanely fun. The new heroes, Obi-Wan, Anakin, Dooku, Grievous, and the way they interact with all each other is just so spot on. It just puts a smile to your face, especially if you're a hardcore Star Wars fan like me. 
And if you haven't picked up this game, because you know the pay to win stuff, and you're still yet hesitant to pick up this game, pick it up. It's pretty cheap. I'm pretty sure you can go to GameStop, buy it used, but if you want to buy it digitally, like, you know, I kind of prefer digital purchases. You know, support the developers, you know, buy copies that, of the games that will help you, but if you can't buy used, it's fine. But definitely check this game out. It's very fun, very intriguing, and it delivers on the Star Wars experience that we are, we wanted. Now, you can argue that it had its flaws, but overall, the immersion, the sounds, everything about it screams Star Wars, and that's the most important part for me. But that's all I got for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for more Star Wars Battlefront 2 content on this channel. News updates. The We got a new game mode coming out. We might get some reinforcements, but we do not know. Anything coming out, I will talk about. Any gameplays you want to see, tips, tricks, will be coming out. But until next time, guys, shout out to you here, and I'm out.